And I think we are live. Uh, so hello, everybody. Welcome to the closing ceremony. Um, and I'm actually going to pass it over to uh, the wonderful Levine from Angel Pack to take this over. So Levine. All right. Hi, everyone. Hope all of you have had an awesome week. Um, if some of you are wondering where Justin went, he's down with COVID and wasn't able to host this session. Let's wish him a speedy recovery and hope he'll recover soon. So together with Urban today, we will be finishing the final lap of Pukada Hackathon North America edition. So I'm sure you're excited to find out who the winners are. Um, thank you for joining us here today. Um, so before we dive into the prizes and winners, I would just like to invite Urban back up again to share how far we have come and the massive opportunities you have ahead of you in the Pukada ecosystem. So Urban, please. Yeah. For sure, thank you very much, uh, Levine. So I'm, I'm gonna try to keep it short. Um, first of all, I'm just very, very thankful and grateful for everybody who's been participating in this. Uh, both the um, participants, obviously, the, the hackers, the builders have come up with some amazing stuff, um, but also the mentors, the judges, all the support staff, the angel hack people who have been uh, working across multiple time zones to, to accommodate this. So, Really, first of all, thank you very much, um, everybody who has contributed to this um, uh, hackathon, to the success of this hackathon in any kind of way, shape, or form. Um, I see we have some uh, mentors and judges in the um, in the uh, channel as well, in the in the chat as well. Hello, Kevin, by the way, from uh, from Moonbeam. I've seen um, Alex from Subsocial and so on. So um, I think it's fantastic to see all the engagement. Um, the Polkadot ecosystem, I think, has come a long way. Um, so people actually don't know this, but um, I started at the Web3 Foundation before Polkadot launched, and it's uh, it's quite surreal to be watching all of this transition from basically just a white paper with uh, with some code into a full-on ecosystem that's obviously still developing, and there's a lot that um, still needs to be done. But um, I think in general we are on a on a really good trajectory and on a really good path. Um, um, towards some massive success. Now, like Levine mentioned, um, I do want to touch a little bit on the opportunities that uh, lie ahead. Right? Because um, this hackathon, it's fantastic, and and you know we've got winners, we've got prizes, um, all of that. But um, the reality is that this is merely a stepping stone for many of you in your journey, in your career, in your uh, professional uh, professional journey. So. Um, I think it's important that we mention that there's um, stuff like the Web3 Foundation grants. We've got you know, the Substrate Builders program. There's a bunch of stuff that the, the ecosystem teams uh, themselves are putting together. So if you browse through um, some of the grant programs from uh, from some of the ecosystem teams and so on. So I think in general, there's a lot, a lot of opportunities to be uh, grasped and to be really taken advantage of. Um, and if at any point, anybody feels lost or you need some help, please reach out to us. We are literally here to uh, help you to the next step, uh, to connect you with the right people, to help you with um, whatever you might need um, to make uh, basically your journey a success. Um, now, with that in mind, um, today what we're going to be doing uh, is obviously this is the closing ceremony and we're going to be announcing winners and all that. Um, but I do want to mention uh, today we're going to be announcing the winners from the five main tracks, uh, the community voting, so the public voting that's been going on, um, and the grand prize. Um, the sponsored prizes are still being, uh, some of them are being finalized, so we didn't want to give out you know, partial uh, winners here and a little bit of information there. So. What's going to happen is that um, the ecosystem teams are going to make public announcements, and we're obviously going to be communicating this uh, for with you, just uh, some housekeeping. So uh, this is it, uh, really, for me. Again, uh, thank you very much to everybody who has participated in this, who has hacked, who has learned something, and who has built something, um, and obviously everybody uh, on the support side that was uh, involved. And a special thank you all. Also to Polkadot Treasury, who has made this happen. Um, the, the prize amount uh, for the main tracks has been fully um, contributed by the Polkadot Treasury. So thank you very much on that side also, who has made this uh, happen. Um, and with that, I think I'm going to pass it uh, back to you, Lillian. All right, nice. Let's all look ahead to the second half of 2022 and also to 2023. So we are constantly improving and seeking to provide a better hackathon experience for everyone. So I hope you can give us your feedback at the end of the session. So it's really important for us to learn what worked really well for you this time and what could be better. 
So, well, it has been quite a journey for you and for us too. We, um, You have experienced six weeks of packing, went through a couple of interesting workshops out of the 25 technical workshops we had. So our mentors have dedicated 22 hours of their time in total to guide you through your projects throughout the six weeks. We have opened the hacker space 12 times for networking alone. And we have met over 130 people at Polkadot Hacker House in New York City. So it's amazing to think about it, um, the amount of time that has been put in to make this happen, the skill of community that we have built, and also the amount of time you have put in to build your project, to network, to consult a mentor, attend workshops, and head down to our hacker house. So we really appreciate your participation and you being here with us through the hackathon means a lot to us. So we would like to extend our thanks to our mentors. Um, the hackathon would not be possible if not for them. So a big thank you to this amazing group of mentors here who supported our participants throughout the mentor office hours. So I believe the participants have greatly benefited from the expertise and mentorship rendered to them during that period of time. Yes. So we would also like to give special thanks to all our judges. So they have spent a long period of time looking through all the submissions and reviewing the codes and documentation. So just give a thumbs up emoji on the chat to show your appreciation towards our judges and mentors. Yeah, maybe I just want to mention here, I don't think people really know how much work uh, the judges put in to go through all these submissions and everything. It, it's really a huge, huge thank you from, from myself as well. Um, I, I've been watching the process uh, in the background and it's just amazing to see um, all the effort that has been put. So two thumbs up from my end. <laughs> <laughs> All right, great. Nice. Okay. Oh. Okay, so we have a huge prize pool of 613,000 USD dollars to give out. So allow me to go through the categories for participation. So our, our winners will also be announced in this order. So the first category we have is interfaces and experiences. The second is DAO and governance. The third is Web3 and tooling. Fourth is DeFi. And lastly, we have NFT. So the next up is the ecosystem team challenges. We have 17 of them. It's quite extensive. Not all of the judging have been finalized for the ecosystem team challenges. And like what Urban mentioned, um, there'll be a public announcement once that's ready. So don't worry about it. Um, and to recap the category prizes, which are funded entirely by Polkadot Treasury, each category winner will have um, three prizes up for grabs. The first place will receive twenty thousand USD dollars. Second place will receive fifteen thousand USD dollars, and the third place will receive ten thousand USD dollars. So all three prizes will include a hackathon swag box, Polkadot engraved ledgers, and feature in Polkadot social media. So we also have the Community Choice Awards, where three winners will be given five thousand USD hackathon swag box, Polkadot engraved ledgers, and also feature in Polkadot social media. And lastly, we have an overall winner. The team will walk away with a grand prize of 30,000 USD with a hackathon swag box, Pugada engraved ledger, and feature in Pugada social media as well. So moving on to the judging criteria, I'm sure most of you are aware of how your projects will be viewed. Um, so our judges spend quite some time reviewing the projects, which is based on a, this set of judging criteria, and I believe you're very familiar with it. The first one is ecosystem impact and usefulness. Second is web tree contribution and advancement. Third is or originality, creativity, and innovation. Fourth is technical difficulty. And lastly, we have mass usability. All right. So, and with that, we have arrived at the slide. It's time to announce the winners. Yay! Okay, <laughs> so are you guys ready? Okay, so let's start off with um, interfaces and experiences category. So this is how we are going to do it. We are going to start with the third place, then the second place, then the first place. So if you're one of the winners, you can give us a wave in emoji just to let us know you're here. And so we will start. The third place goes um, to... Polkadot Point of Sale Terminal. Ooh, yay. Yeah. Congratulations. Congratulations <laughs> on winning 10,000 USD dollars. So if you're here, send over a wave emoji so that everyone can congratulate you too. Okay, so moving on to the second place, we have Sub Social Substrate Stack Exchange. Ooh. 
Ooh. Congratulations on winning fifteen thousand dollars. Yeah, very cool submission. Some of these are really, really cool. Yes. Very nice. Hope you're here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the first sorry, the first place goes to Moonbridge for winning twenty thousand USD dollars. Yay, Congratulations. Yay. Oh hey, you're here. Okay. Awesome. Everybody's here. Awesome. Congrats, yeah. everybody. Yeah, Fantastic. Congratulations. Moonbridge. Really good work. Yeah. Yep. So I'll be passing on to Urban who will be announcing the winners for DAO and governance. Cool. Awesome. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, the third place goes to da -da -da -da, drum roll. Let's see it. I, I, I can't click, Levine. <laughs> <laughs> so, Shivarta has won the third place. Yay, congrats, team. Uh, Blockchain-based decentralized governance and funding system. Fantastic, uh, fantastic submission. Second place goes to... And the booster DAO. Fantastic. Yeah. This one was a really cool one as well. Um, yeah, I, I've seen it pop up uh, here and there. I actually looked at it. It's fantastic. Uh, really cool stuff. Uh, good job, guys. I uh, hope you're here. If not, uh, you'll be hearing from us. And the first place, ooh, let's see it. The Diora Network. Fantastic. This one was also really, really cool. Um, I think the judges really like this one as well. Um, I've looked through it as well. This is something very awesome. So, uh, yeah, and there you are, Dagmar. Uh, hey, uh, congrats. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. Uh, really cool stuff here. And with that, I think, Levine, uh, you are next with Web3 and Tuli. OK, so I hope you guys are ready for this one. So the third place goes to <laughs> Samaritan OS. Yay. Thank you for your submission. So yeah, you have won ten thousand. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> yes. All right, the second place now. Let's see. And, it. and we have next step. So give us ah. a wave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Congratulations. Congratulations. Awesome. Okay. And, and the winner. The winner is post thread really amazing cool. awesome <laughs> really happy to cool. see all of you some of you here it's really <laughs> cool. all right let's go into ooh, the DeFi category this one was uh intense competition so third place goes to uh, yes the polka dot color a usd credit card <laughs> Congratulations, team. Fantastic, really cool submission as well. And second place goes to the Robo5. <laughs> awesome. Congratulations, yeah, team. Good. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. Awesome project. <laughs> okay. And, and, and the first <laughs> one goes to. Akala Eldog Youth Manager. Congratulations, team. Very cool stuff from you. Very cool stuff. That's great. We're <laughs> happy to hear you're excited. <laughs> yeah. And with that, um, Levine, you're up for the, the NFT category. Yes. All right. So one of the last categories. Okay. So let's start with the third place. We have Venture NT NFT Palette. Thank you so much for your submissions. A really yeah. cool project. Awesome. Non transferable NFTs with a substrate palette. Very cool to see. I think the judges uh, were quite impressed by this. Yeah. So, the second phase will be Sociable Weaver. Yay. Yes. Bad. <laughs> yes. We are walking away with 15,000 USD dollars. Hope you're feeling good about that. <laughs> All right. The first phase we have. See it? Is it, is it lagging? <laughs> We're not seeing it. Ah, the color dot. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Yes, Congrats. congratulations, Koda Awesome. Koda dot team. Add it again. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. So let's congratulations teams. Um. So now we are moving on to community choice awards. 
Um, so we have three winners and they are announced in no particular order. So first we have music. It's really cool. Yay. I've seen this one around uh, music NFTs. Very cool stuff, guys. Very cool stuff. All right, great. Okay, so the other winner is Brewster Dow. Brewster Dow. <laughs> Congratulations <laughs> again. <laughs> yes, again. <laughs> All right. Okay, the last winner of Comedy Choice goes to Sociable Weaver. Congratulations Ooh. again to. <laughs> yeah, you've seen this one before. Congratulations. <laughs> yes. All right. Okay. Ooh, All right. Overall winner. Now, a little bit of a drum roll. Ooh. Yeah. I think All I'm right. really excited for this. Let's see it. I'm super excited for this one. Let's see it. Okay, are you guys ready? <laughs> okay, let's go. Woo! XM dot auto stake. Yay! Congratulations. Congratulations. Yay, awesome. Awesome. Very cool stuff indeed. Um, I think for the overall grand prize, uh, there were, it was not so far apart. We've had a few that were uh, kind of uh, really above, but uh, this one, I think um, the judges really, really like this one. So congratulations um, to the team that built this. Awesome. Amazing stuff. Yes. Nice. Really excited for all yeah. of you. And with that, I think we've actually wrapped up um, the whole prize giving. Um, so, like I said, uh, this is just the, the prizes for the main tracks. Um, our sponsor teams, uh, the ecosystem teams, will be making announcements um, on their channels. We're going to make sure that this is uh, properly communicated to you guys as well. Um, but yeah, so this is it for the uh, for the uh, actual main part of this presentation, uh, Levine. But we do have something that we do want to share as well, right? Yes, and it's a very special announcement to make. So let's go on to the next slide. Yeah. Ta-da. Yay. So the special announcement, um, we are working um, with the Angel Hack team and obviously uh, a bunch of other uh, people to bring to you a in-person hackathon. We've been doing uh, online stuff for uh, ever since I joined the Web3 Foundation, actually. <laughs> We've been doing online stuff. Um, so we're going to be in Europe um, in Q4. Um, we just don't have any details yet uh, on where and when and so on, but we will make sure to uh, to follow up with uh, everybody. Um, so yeah, I'll hope to see you in, in Europe in Q4. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely looking forward to that. <laughs> All right. Okay. So thank you so much for being with us on this journey. It has been an amazing experience with participants, mentors, judges, and the Web3 Foundation. So we really appreciate it if you can help us by uh, giving us your feedback by scanning the QR code on the right to help us improve. So please help us yes. to fill up the feedback form. We really appreciate it. So again, congratulations to everyone who wants something. Uh, for this Polkadot Hackathon North America edition. So if you're happy about the results, drop more emojis in the chat mm -hmm. box to let us know you're happy. <laughs> cool. Right. With but yeah, thank you very much, really. I think it was a fantastic experience. Uh, yeah, the, the six weeks of hacking and the period leading up to it, the Hacker House in New York and all of it that was going on. I mean, we had Polkadot decoded in about halfway. So there was a lot of uh, Polkadot related stuff going on. Um, but like Levine said, please, please, please scan this QR code. Tell us um, what worked, what didn't work. Um, it, it's actually really important for us to make these uh, events better as we move along. And this is one way um, that you can genuinely convey your uh, your feedback on multiple areas. It's going to take you somewhere between five to ten minutes to finish this. So it's not a overly long thing, and it really helps us. So thank you very much, everybody. Uh, Levine, any final words? No, it's just, just a really huge thank you to the Web3 Foundation for powering us to do this hackathon. Yeah, cool. thank you so much. And thanks, everyone, for attending this session. All right, thank you. I'll see you guys around. Thank you very much. Have a nice day and uh, enjoy your prizes, I guess. <laughs> Cheers. Yep, enjoy. Bye.